Hello, welcome back my students. How are you today? I'm so happy to meet with you again. Today we're going to be working on another lesson to help you understand your mathematic problem. Keep on watching and let's begin. begin. Oh no, I don't know what to do. The rabbits are stealing my vegetables again. I shall build a fence around my garden so that I can keep the rabbits out. But how I can do that? How I can figure out how much fence I need? How can I calculate that? Mm. Let's see. Mm. First, I need to figure out the perimeter. The perimeter is the total distance around something. We can think of the perimeter as an outline around something. The lines in the grass show the perimeter of the soccer field. These dotted lines show the perimeter of this piece of land. The map shows the perimeter of each state. But you can also find the perimeter of small things, like this square. We can also find the perimeter of the windows of a house. Good question, my students. How do we find perimeter? How do we find perimeter? You can find the perimeter of a shape or a figure by adding the length of all its sides together. The measurements of the sides of these packets of seed are 5 and 10 centimeters. To find the perimeter, add the length together. The perimeter is 30 centimeters. Let's find the perimeter of this triangle. Each side of this triangle is 6 feet long. So now we have to add 6 plus 6 plus 6. In this case, we got a repeated addition sentence. We can add the 6 three times or, as we already know multiplication, we can multiply 6 times 3 and that's equal 18. So the perimeter of this triangle is 18 feet. Now let's find the perimeter of my garden. To find the perimeter, add the length of all the sizes together. 2 plus 8 plus 2 plus 6. Mm, I know it's a long number sentence. That's why I'll add the easiest numbers first. 2 plus 8 equals 10. Then 2 plus 6 equals 8. Then it's very easy to add 10 plus 8, which is equal to 18. It's helpful to break up long number sentences into smaller ones to help you add. So the perimeter of this trapezoid is 18. Figuring out the perimeter can help you build or design things. I want to build a fence that goes around my garden. Come on guys, let's find the perimeter of my garden so that I can know how much fence I need. This is a quick reminder because we already did this. We already found this perimeter. So remember that we have to add all the sizes length and we're going to have the correct perimeter. So the perimeter of my garden is 18 feet. Well, we're almost at the end of the video, guys. I want to give you a quick reminder about area and perimeter. Remember that area is the inside space of a shape. In area, we just multiply the length times the width to find the inside space. In perimeter, we have to add all the sizes together, like in this case, 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4, and that will give us the perimeter of this square, which is 16. 
Yay! We have reached the end of the video. Bye, guys. See you next time. Remember to subscribe and like the video. Have fun with math.